Whatever you will find deliverance, wherever you will find healing, wherever you find a move of God, it is always associated with a sound. So by your spirit I will rise from the ashes of defeat. The resurrected King is resurrecting me. By your name I come alive to declare your victory. Come on, say. The resurrected King is resurrecting us. Hi gang, it's your girl Ed Shanice and today I'll be sharing with you just a part of my personal life. For all the persons who took the time to watch these videos, subscribe and like, I appreciate you so much. Now as you can see, I have something over my mouth and yes, I'm asthmatic. I wasn't born with it, I grew and I developed it over time. As a child, I had to walk 4 miles per day, alright? Two in the morning, two in the afternoon, and then I realized that I had a short of breath, you know. So I started off on the pill and then went to pumps. Then I went to this powdery thing, this canister. It's very weird. It they all worked until one day here in America. I realized my pumps weren't working. So a friend of mine took the nebulizer to me it helped a bit but in the morning I literally had to find a doctor I couldn't breathe the moment I tried to sleep I immediately jumped up because I felt like my body wasn't getting any oxygen and so I couldn't sleep at all a day had passed and I didn't sleep the next day I still didn't sleep so I was very weary so what you're seeing right now is me in my car at the doctor. I could not get in. They didn't allow us to go in, but they came out to us. They prescribed medications and all, and all that. And guess what? I had to take the coronavirus test. I knew I didn't have it, but like... This test is so serious and it's so weird. It wasn't all that painful, but it was a weird feeling and my nose just felt weird after that. My eyes were teary and it was just not it. I was a hot mess. <laughs> but this is a life or death situation, guys. As my patients, it's, it's very serious. You can die at any moment because your body isn't getting enough oxygen. Right now, I'm so grateful to be alive because this experience, the experience of having asthma has taught me a lot. Never take things for granted. Never. Hey, one more time. Okay, we're all done. <laughs> oh, I know, I'm sorry. My eyes are no teary. But he will be out here shortly, okay? Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Oh my god, my no, oh my god, Ooh. oh that, that's, that's, hard. that's rough, mm. maybe I'm exaggerating but it's really weird, my eyes are running, my eyes got red, oh my goodness, that's what it's like here guys, mm. So here I am, leaving the doctor's office, trying to figure out which direction I should turn. I could drive anywhere. So I took my right turn and I'm on my way to the pharmacy. It was raining. I got four medication, two pumps. One of the pumps literally cost 
200 and odd dollars and I got an antibiotic and another medication in tablet form so I'm on my way to Walmart that's where I do all my shopping well most of my shopping let's be clear <laughs> So right now guys I'm just truly grateful and you know I can just say God is good all the time and all the time God is good and if your faith is as small as a mustard seed trust me you will see God working in your life he will say that mountain will move trust me okay right now I'm at Walmart and I'm just showing you the parking lot it has a lot of cars usually there would be more but it's like it doesn't matter how early you go that to that place it's loaded with vehicles and people so i'm walking towards the entrance and i'm walking to the pharmacy entrance i, li I literally did a fish dance when she told me the price of my medications let's just get that out of the way <laughs> i guess i can't be dramatic after all <laughs> But right now I'm just truly grateful and I just can't wait to get these medications so that I can start taking them and feel a little better. Just showing you a sneak peek of the things that I purchased there and that cost like maybe 30 something dollars. But wait on the total price for my medication guys. Mm. I left. And yes, I'm now on my way home, and I'm there jamming to some reggae music. Yes, Chronics in the place. Chronics in the place, people. That's what I do. I'm all still a lead by iTunes. I'm going home, people. No, we don't do it for the likes, so we tell them we do it for the love. We don't do it for the likes. Here are the culprits. These are the culprits. Ready for the price? Let's round it down to two hundred dollars. Believe it. Two hundred dollars. It's two hundred something. Unbelievable. For learning before you go old. For learning is better than silver and gold. Silver and gold will vanish away, but a good education will never decay. Proverbs sixteen verse sixteen. How much better is it to get wisdom than gold? And to get understanding rather to be chosen than silver. A question to be asked, yet to be answered. I'm going to allow you to reflect on that and come up with your own understanding. Until then, peace out. Gang, the results came back and guess what? I know you know you girl. You girl don't have no coronavirus, okay? <laughs> we ban that in the name of Jesus. We cancel that and we send it back to the pit of 